<laughs> Love? Are you here yet? Hoss? My love, here I am. I'm here. I was waiting for you. I want to give you a surprise. Oh, thanks, love. How are you? <laughs> Great. Hey. Do you know if Janet is here? I invited her over to eat with us. Uh, no, honey. I haven't seen her, but I can call her to see where she is. Sure, please call her. All right. Ah, bestie! <laughs> Sorry, I missed you so much. Oh, you know I always miss you. <laughs> you scared me. <laughs> you have no idea of how happy I am to have two wonderful people such as yourselves in my life. My best friend and my boyfriend. <laughs> how are you, Hush? Hey there, Janet. So good to see you again. <laughs> I'm glad you could make it. Ah, oh, just funny. I'm so happy to have you in my life. <laughs> oh, honey. I'm so glad you like this watch. They told me at the store it was the latest model. <laughs> I honestly love it, darling. Thank you very much. <laughs> I'm glad. <laughs> okay, that's cool. That's enough love for today. <laughs> Well, why don't you tell me what you want to eat? Um, I don't know. I have to think about it. Well, what if while we decide, we go and ask for it in my room? There are some stuff I have to do there. All right. Yes? Come on. Come on. Oh, are you leaving the bag down here? Yes, honey. Can you do it yourself or do you need help? I could on my own, but I like it when you help me. Uh. <laughs> I just can't stand her. I hate it when she plays to be the sweetest girl in the world. Crazy babe. I can see you're losing your patience. But Joswani cannot find out you can stand her. Baby, I just can't stand sharing you. I already told you I have no feelings for her. Me and a blind girl? <laughs> That's never gonna happen. Ever. I know. Do you trust me? Alright. I trust you. Okay. <laughs> Honey, is the food here already? Uh, no, darling, almost. Hey, guys, the truth is, I wanted to share with you real important news at the office, but I can't hold it anymore. I have a surprise for you. A surprise? What are tell you us, tell us, about? Tell us, please. I'm impatient. Uh, well, I've been following your work at the office, and honestly, results have been rising. I think it's time you have a bigger project. Oh, are you saying we get to lead a project? That's right. <laughs> wow! You'll be in charge of the new project with our Canadian colleagues. And I don't want you to think I'm doing this because we are close. You two have proven you're capable of getting really far. And well, my dad agree. Oh, love, this is incredible. I promise you, we'll put all our effort in it. Oh, yes, I know. Do you just trust us? We'll do it perfectly. Hey, Bestie, change the subject a bit. Do you still wear a dress that's all the way on the front of the right? It's just gorgeous. Can I borrow it? Of course. You can keep it if you want. Oh! <laughs> Why is the food taking forever? Uh, I don't know. I'll check in a bit. Good morning, Miss Joswani. How are you today? Good day, Doctor. I'm fine. Thank you. And you? I'm really excited. I have great news for you, Joswani. Yes? Yes. We already did the analysis and... Well, guess what? We can start with the paperwork for your surgery. 
Are you serious? Mm -hmm. That's right. The analysis we did on you states we have a 50% chance you'll get your sight back. <gasps> That's way more than I expected. Yes, it is. But the only thing is you'll have to go to the United States since we don't have that kind of equipment here. And keep some recovery time in mind also. And uh, how much time would that be approximately, doctor? Well, I would say it is about a week. A week? Well, I just have to talk to my family about it, yes? Alright. I would appreciate your response as soon as possible. This week at most, because I need to start with the paperwork, sending documents and everything we need. Also, I need you to have a companion. It's necessary to have company along the process, which might be a little bit complicated. Yes, I'll just talk to my family and you'll have an answer by tomorrow. And also, I am going to need you to bring some documents as well. Oh, Beastie, I'm so glad you called. I was literally thinking about you. You were? Uh, oh, we are so insane. <laughs> hey, so you know I went out in the morning? Well, I have very important news to give you. Mm -hmm. Well, I went to Hold the talk. I'm gonna go first. Oh, it's a huge news, bestie. The other day, I was talking to Josh. Uh huh. And guess what he said? What did he say? He told me he couldn't be without you for so long, <laughs> and he's gonna ask you to marry him. <gasps> I can't believe it! I thought he'd never do it! Oh, Bestie, what are you talking about? That's nonsense! You're his whole world! Hmm? So get ready! Cause you're yes. getting married! Okay, that's that. Tell me, what were you gonna tell me? Uh, I... Uh, I have to go out on a trip. It's business. It's a very special client. I'll be gone for a week. Oh, you're gonna do great, bestie. Just take care, all right? Yes, of course. Get married? I thought I'd never hear that word. I'm so happy I found love. Surprising them is what's best. I won't say a word. I'm sure that if everything works out, they'll be very happy. <laughs> no way. What is it? The mom got up. She was able to walk. You know, she was lying to her daughter, right? Uh -huh. Because it turned out she wanted her to marry a rich guy, but she's in love with the village's doctor. <laughs> oh. Hey, honey. Hmm? I wanted to tell you. I have to leave the country because there's a very important client that my father wants me to attend. Oh, honey. <laughs> I'll miss you like crazy. But well, since it's business, I guess I can stop you. <laughs> Oh, I'll miss you lots as well, honey. But it'll be just a week. Well, uh, I'll have to learn to live without you. Mm. Look, if you want, you can stay here. That way you won't miss me as much. Okay? You know where the key is already. Ah, uh, yes, love. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> now tell me, what's going on in the movie? Uh, it's gonna be the wedding day. They caught her, but he slept over right next to her. <gasps> but well, keep on listening, okay? Uh -huh. <sighs> Did you hear? Yes. Want me to tell you more? The time I was away from Hush, I realized he was the one I wanted to be by my side. After the surgery, I couldn't believe the results. I just wanted to go back to be next to him.
here. Oh, gosh. I'm so glad you stayed home. <laughs> yes, darling. I wanted to surprise you, but it, you won. <laughs> you told me you were staying one more week. What happened? Yeah, I know. Everything was faster than I expected. Oh. <laughs> what is that smell? What are you talking about? You smell like women's perfume. Uh, yeah. The thing is, uh, yesterday I was checking for some to buy you. Mm. I, I wanted to surprise you. Oh, love. You're always so considerate. Uh, well, uh, I'll go make some breakfast. You must be starving from your trip. Yes. Mm. for the big day? You have no idea of how much I've waited for this. And I can't believe after you told me about the proposal, you didn't tell me how it'll be. Oh, bestie. I love me some tea, but I don't drink a lot at once. Hmm. What I can say is, it's gonna be unforgettable. <laughs> I'm so excited. I trust you to leave me stunning. Count on it, girl. You'll be glorious, <laughs> which you already are. Yes. Okay, let me see if Kosh is here. Hmm? Okay. You don't know how happy I am to have you in my life. I wanted to prepare this wonderful dinner. There's candles all over the house, balloons, even rose petals. I'd love for you to see it. By the way, you look gorgeous. <laughs> and I bought you your favorite flowers. I'm so thankful as well, because someone like you came to my life. Thanks to you, I've been able to experience emotions I didn't even know I had. Oh, honey, I was waiting for the right moment to tell you something. The time we've been together is only the beginning of our story. We live in this house with a huge family and we'll take the business to success. Gosh, you leave me speechless. But I also have a surprise for you. What is it, just honey? Uh, could you please give me back all I ever bought for you? You know, the phone and the watch. You may keep your clothes. I guess they're the ones that got you, right? Uh, what is this all about? You'll see. Janet, are you still here? Yes. Can I have the accessories I got you, please? What do you need them for? You'll see. Whatever you have in here. Look. I know material things are really important for you. That's why I'm doing this. You thought you could play with me because I was blind? What's wrong with you? Are you crazy? Not my stuff. Well, guess what? That business trip I did was to get surgery. Hoping to surprise you because I got my side back. And the first thing 
I see coming back is my best friend and my boyfriend on my bed. But how is this possible? Can you can you see? It's not what you're thinking, Jasoni. You bastard! I hate you! I can't believe you were doing this all along with not even a bit of remorse. What? What were your plans? Hubby ever after for the three of us? No, no, no. We didn't. We, we, we just. Uh... But bestie, calm down. Don't ever call me that again. You're fired. And I'll take care. No company ever hires you again. No, wait, you can do this to me. That company is meant to be mine. Fuck off! I don't want to see you again. Out of my life. Sometimes the ones who are closer to us are the most dangerous ones. Having a disability doesn't make you useless or dumb. We all have feelings. And betrayal is unforgivable. 